Yeah, Garrus has all this slightly minus stuff. Yeah. And he has a six frame down one to check you if you do something. So I'm like, I'm checking him so he doesn't check me, but he didn't do it very often. Yep. But anyway, it is what it is. Who are the dragon versus? Oh, no, those are semis, right, right. We're gonna see more Gears all night long. Gears, 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 boys. Is, is, you think this character touch over power? Uh, to our, let, let's let's give the game what? time before we cry about character balance, please. She's a t he's a touch, but I think I think he's uh I think it's less that he's too good and more. So there's a couple characters that are very lackluster. I think that is the biggest issue. Like. I feel like a lot of people have been saying like Raiden is like very lackluster. He's very lackluster. The main thing is that with Raiden and some of the other characters, their crushing blow requirements are ridiculous. Yeah, they're too hard. You're never going to land them in a real match, whereas fucking Garrus has like three or four that you land every time. Yeah. So he's getting 30% off every touch. Very common. And his mix ups are so strong, and his, yeah. his normals are fantastic. Back two on its own is minus two on block and advances very far. Yeah, he's got good non flawless blockable normals. So even like if the meta were to advance, but we'll see. So Corey is a maniac, but he is really good at the style. He is just teleport canceling all over the place. 300 early damage. Now, I, I, I've always said that uh, he is kind of a maniac, but there's something. I, I don't know, I wouldn't be able to tell you what it is, but there's some kind of method. He's always thinking about like exposing something he's seen or knows about the person. And he has played uh, Onisan a lot. They were training, they were training partners in Justice 2. So yeah. he knows a lot about uh, Onisan as a person. So he might be trying to use that against him now. Plus he's been seeing- That's not a real tonight. tick throw. That's a real tick throw, okay. Now uh, down four is a real tick throw yeah. block. That one, interestingly enough. It's very good. Yeah, he's going crazy right now. Two teleport cancels and then to the regular Doesn't teleport. Doesn't want to get hit. It's scary, and that's kind of like Garrus can not play his game. Nobody can play their game versus Scorpion. That teleport is too powerful, and it just everyone just relax. Like right there, free punch. Well, it's gonna punish himself, but not much. Could have got a bigger punch than that. Nice tick throw. It's good. Fifteen percent. Corner time. Oh, but he just jumps out. Yeah. Okay. Footsies. Look at that. Just, it's madness. You can't keep track of him. He's so fast. I found that uh, when I fought Corey... 50-50, uh, it's going to hit. I, fa oh. I found that I was more <laughs> likely to beat the teleport if I mashed than I was to get hit by it. Yes, and that, that is something you can do. But he does have ways of baiting that too. He'll yes. do the empty teleport, walk Ooh. back into the normal, and then yeah, catch yeah. you. And, and depending on the which character you're playing, some characters down one to recover fast enough to block the back one. Which yeah. is the normal he used in that situation, but that is character dependent. Some characters uh, down ones are too cover too slowly. And right there, the jump kick into the teleport. You know, only someone would normally block that, but he's, it's just so much going on that he doesn't know when to do his stuff. With just, punish on the down too. Yeah, it's scary. No full conversion though. But Core always has no meter because he always is blowing through it super fast. So if only someone can land a hit. Yeah, the Oki will be very strong because he has no way of using an invincible breakup to get out of it. Did it again. All he has to do is get a touch. Uh, yeah. Or does he go for delay wake up and uh, avoids the overhead? Okay, he's starting to get that down one poke though, but he doesn't have a. Ooh, that was not a real punish, but it's hard. You're scared. You don't know when to stick up the normals. That's a low. That's a low overhead. Let's the overhead rock in the 1 1 1. No Breaks more. out of the combo. Does not want to get. Ooh, trades out of it. That's unfortunate. Okay. Oh, oh delay wake up. Delay wake up. Makes him miss the timing on the, the command grab. He does. Corey is enjoying himself. Corey always has a smile on his face. He's a maniac. He's so happy. Look how happy he is. He is literally insane. Look at that. Okay, he spent two bars already and then spends the third. And then Onisan's not ready for it and he misses the punish. Again, spends the bar. It's He's, like Cory the Dragon was made to play Scorpion. Yeah, this is actually exactly. Onisan is tilted. He is not. He blocked two <laughs> EX teleports. He tried to in down through the, the teleport yeah. he, tried, he tried to block two EX teleports, tried to punish and failed both of them. Cory is running rampant. This is an annihilation right now. And not and, and not the Mortal Kombat movie. That movie was terrible. Was that the second one? Yeah, that was. I never saw that one. That, that movie. 
All I remember a lot about that movie is I remember Smoke was cool, and I remember Shao Kahn was very campy, and Sindel screamed a lot. Somebody just walked I look, by. I look back and forth, the dragon was still telling me. Somebody just walked by and just whispered in my ear, you suck. I got a guy. I see a lot of cans that I didn't sell. Oh. Look at that again. He's just going with these teleport mixes. The overhead, that overhead is safe, correct? Which one? The, 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 the flip kick? Yes. Yeah. It's like minus six, so it's not his turn anymore, but it's safe. 50 50. No. Oh, wow. Ooh, sure off to beat the command throw. I'll be honest, I don't know if that was entirely intentional, but it works. That is that is how you're supposed to beat command throws in this game. Ooh, Go not. overhead with whip punches and jumping backward. Goes for raw command throw. This is corner time. Gears. Now I will say about Onisan is Onisan is very good at reading people. He's been a grappler player for a long time. Oh, when see. he gets a read on you, the longer the game is advanced, the more time passes, the more he learns how to deal with things. He's very good at uh, adapting. Is that why you kept switching characters against him? That is, uh, Cory the Dragon, uh, I, that was to keep him moving against Onisan. Uh, oh, yeah, they're both good. Yeah. Oni Onisan is a very good adaptive player, whereas Cory uh, lacks matchup knowledge. So I tried to use matchup knowledge against him by watching characters a lot. For the most part, it worked. I just I made this for my era. He's afraid to start anti-ring now, and Cory is, is now. Honestly, that jump three is terrifying. Yeah, like, it's, it's really so good. right there. He tried it. Full cool combo. Just, so like, yeah. it, that plus the teleport, oh, he is oh. not he is not willing to try an anti anymore. So at this point. Oh, he goes for it. As yeah, I say that, there. he goes for it. Yeah, it can't work, but like if you're wrong, that's 30%. Oh, yeah. that's a free punish, but nothing else. Wow, Ooh. flawless block. I'm pretty sure that wasn't intentional, but Full we'll take lock. that. Just knock him down, 270. Oh, that's a punish. Doesn't let him break, though. Ooh. That's the thing, too. He needs to <laughs> chill with that. Like, I get it. Yeah, the, the teleport cancels are cool. But yeah. he did not even need to spend he, two in a row right he's there. Playing, he's almost playing Scorpion like a Brainiac player. He's a maniac. Not a Brainiac. He's a <laughs> maniac. Like, there was no reason to spend that bar. And now, two two. yeah, Onisan is within kill range. He spends oh, the bar. He needs touch in the crushing blow. Any, any hit could do it. Oh, he's been there both. But did not, get the, did not confirm the fatal blow. Yep. Oh, yep. beats his fatal blow. Oh, Mashing ass. Maniac. <laughs> one uh, one straight hit. Because when he when he stuffed Corey's uh, fatal blow, if the next 2-1-2 two two had been on point, or he had gone for a jump, that situation might have been a real a real clencher. A real butt clencher there. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> sure. Okay, did that, but just look at the madness. Raw confirmed? Yeah, Onisan is definitely gonna have to look at this again when he gets home, because he's gotta figure out how he's supposed to deal with this. Because this is just a bunny rabbit. What do you think teleport. what do you think the right way is to deal with this? Honestly, I, I, I played Corey last night, and we'll see how I do if he does win. That was max range? No. Um, I just let him burn the bar, and then I just wait, because I know he's going to do a regular or EX teleport at some point, and I just punish him. I just, I let him teleport all around me like a maniac. I'm like, alright, whatever, I can't stop this, this is too much. But right now, Onison's doing great just with the corner pressure. It's almost a chip out. One. Now, uh, Giris does not have the best uh, chip out game, no. per se. Uh, I think other characters are definitely better at that than him, but he does have the fact that his kick throw is a mid, his command throw. So it's like you, it makes you not want to have to sit still, even no matter how much life you have. Yeah, it's, it is kind nice of punish. punish. Yeah, cannot do that versus Garrus. Ah, no punish again. He's got to do, I think, 1-1. One, 1-1 one. One, one into the freeze. No, just down one, that's not going to cut it. And Corey's gonna get a punch, but not much else either. And just spends the bar. He's gonna not nice anti-air. Does not get a conversion off of it. Just goes for Oki. Corey is, Corey is a big believer in delayed wake up. He's, it's one of his favorite options. He goes for a very quick one. Does gets the punish. It is good. There we go. Misses the misses conversion. It. Oh, whip punches it down to. Oh my goodness. Drops out. Does not get the punish on the swift spear though. Body splash and it whips because the, when Scorpion does back one, his hitbox leans down. Just double teleport and right there he spends it. See, that's what I'm talking about. Again? Just wait for him to do that. He will do that teleport eventually. That's the only way. And roll, 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 roll. Okay, now he's got one, his own. One he, good hit. 
Wake up down two. What that is the most Cory the Dragon thing I've seen all night. He's a maniac. He's trying to control him, but no dice on the fatal blow. Let's go. <laughs> What match point for Cory the Dragon? <laughs> okay, playing some footsies, but again, two Ooh, quick cancels whip into the, the down two breakaway. Does not wake up in time to punish the whiff spear. That is unfortunate. Oh, that's a Ooh. jump in. That's that a jump in. Hits right. the conversion this time. Twenty-four percent. Wave dashes in and tires him out of the air. Does not get a conversion, but gets the meaty. Yeah, he's getting his game going right now. He's rushing him down right now. Spends he it. Does not get a bigger punish. I, I feel like Onisan is missing the important damage. He is. Yeah, literally just 1-1 one, one into the freeze, and that's good for Gira. Like, you, you can't let him... I understand that teleports are terrifying to keep track of. But just nice. 4-2-2 two, two, two to catch his feet. Now, on 4-2-2 two, two crushing blows... Uh, it's is the crushing blow on a whiff punish or counter hit? On um, counter hit. Which, if you get it off of the command grab variation, right, and they try and jump, it counts as a counter hit. Uh, That's why it's so fucked up. Ah, <laughs> uh, I see. So if they if they jump and they're getting hit by the as they jump, then it's. Yeah. Oh, that's cheap. That's what I'm saying. His, his crushing blows are so easy. He has that <laughs> one. He has the one off the mix-up, the overhead and the low. Yeah. Um, his command grab one is a crushing blow. Where it's like, yeah, just ma carry him max distance. That one's, I feel like, it's a harder than the others. It is harder than the others, Facing but it's just... specific. Like, there are moves that he will use regularly, and they just... That, now, that 4 2, two low is, is punishable, correct? I believe it is punishable. I don't know, to be honest. I haven't seen anybody punish it yet. Everybody's scared. Everyone doesn't, <laughs> everyone doesn't want to mess with him. I'm, you're trying to zone him, but then you realize you can't. Okay, uh, that's a full punch there. Yeah, it, it's it's hard. Like I, I playing Cabal, like if I if I jump and do my air fireball in good placing, it's very hard for him to punish it. Yeah. But for the most part, oh. those characters cannot zone out uh, here. Yeah. Two one two. He's trying to bait a whiff right now? Well, that was punishable, but nothing. Minus 15, I believe. Does not go for the conversion. Instead, wants the Oki. Just press some pokes into the cancels. No anti -air. Get down one check if good. That is punishable as well. That 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 shoulder string into that, that is punishable. Yeah. It's not by a lot, but it's something. Oh, there it is. Tick good. All the way to the corner. Just spends it. Spends two bars. And the Those cancel. Oh, that tech. was a very good tech throw. I was about to say that was like a throw for sure. He's going crazy. Corey, Corey's going. Corey can smell blood. He sees he sees the, the fatal blow meter and wants no part of that comeback. Oh, that's not a tick throw. Oh, and he does oh. it. That should be well, he's gonna break her. Yeah. One more situation. That's Ooh, that is game. Corey the dragon takes it. 3-1. He advances. Loses the final.